Hi, welcome to this special edition of the Freeman Conversations. It's beauty pageant season once again, and one pageant here in Cebu will make history tomorrow as it crowns its very first queen. I'm Joe Bert Ocon, the online editor of The Freeman, and joining me today is Vanessa Balbuena, our entertainment editor. Hello, Hi. Vanessa. Tomorrow, Bidibining Cebu will be crowning its very first winner. Are you excited? One more night. Is one more night. night. Is we will all know who will make history as the first Binibining Cebu. Of course, we're all excited and relieved that this will all be finally over and we will know who will be the queen. <laughs> Why relieved? <laughs> You've been following the candidates since day one. Busy ang life. Kung busy right. sila na busy puti because of them. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, aside from Vanessa, we have promised to give you a fearless forecast of tomorrow's winners for us. And joining us today to give his take on this year's pageant is of course our columnist in Banat News and the head of entertainment of ABS-CBN Cebu. Please welcome to the Freeman Conversations and today's fearless forecast, Adrian Dionzo. <laughs> Welcome to the Freeman Conversation. Welcome. Oh, this is very good at one. I'm finally here. Hello guys, the friends who are watching for today. We're giving you, in just a bit, our top 5 picks for Billy Bean Cebu 2017. Yes. Yes. I always read your column in Banat, huh? All oh the my blind God. Tomorrow, I am. But you never tell me who they are. Yeah, but I, I'm over. Did you come confirm? <laughs> your column in Banat News for those who It comes out every Saturday. It's called Attitude sa mga feeling diva, mga acti, mga hilas, feeling hilas. Attitude. So watch out, it's a new number of attitude, but India is a rock. Yeah. So be the subject of his blind item. He will be our check. <laughs> but for today's Freeman Conversations, we have dedicated this, this special edition mm -hmm. for Bini Bini Cebu. Okay. But of course, before we go to your choices, we would like, of course, to say congratulations to our another Cebuana who made mm -hmm. Cebu and the Philippines proud in the international scene. Mm -hmm. She represented Mandawa City mm -hmm. during last May's Bini Bini Philippines. Yes. And Wednesday night, night, Wednesday night, she won as second runner up, of course, for the first. Uh, the second time, no? Na the pageant playing in Vietnam. Yeah. And then, of course, Miss Peru won the. Crowd. Miss Grand International. Miss Grand International. International. And of course, we're talking about. Elizabeth Elizabeth, Elizabeth Dorado Dorado Clancy. Clancy. Yes. Congratulations, Elizabeth. Um, in the five years that we've been sending girls to this pageant, yeah. placed three times in the top five. First was Parol Shah, mm -hmm. oh, okay. second, okay. third runner-up, and mm -hmm. then Nicole Cordova's last year. Last she, year. Won. she almost won the crown. She landed first runner-up. Uh -huh. And then this year, we maintain a second runner-up. Yes. At least all our candidates for the past three years have made it to the top five. And uh, incidentally, Nicole also hosted this year's pageant. With Zia Lim. With Zia yeah. Lim. So, you can see the Philippines, the Vidas have won. I'm making it to right, the right, right. international level, of course, following the roots of um, First of all, uh, Chris Hanson, yes. we have Carla Henry. Yes. Jenica Takuta. Yes. Yes. And speaking of Cebuana, so mm. Joanna, you know, we had an Aces and Queens screening mm. here right. last yeah. September. Yeah. 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 And our entertainment reporter, Carla, asked Jonas Gaffo, you know, is there a difference with the Manila screening and Cebu screening? And of course, Jonas said that they're all beautiful. Mm. Beautiful lang taga Manila, beautiful po lang taga Cebu. But the difference yeah. though is Cebuanas though are eloquent. Wow. Really? Uh, yeah. Which is of course very important, especially in international pageants. Exactly. Like, like in, in, of course, we have already sent, if we haven't yet, mm -hmm. candidates to other international pageants such as Miss World mm -hmm. and upcoming Miss Universe. Yes. And in Miss International, mm -hmm. right? I, I remember seeing in Miss International, they actually have to deliver a speech there. Yes. Yes. Also Miss World. You're giving us a question. But of course, ba, kita nilang, para goal na ko, ako pinaka, yatangan is that the time comes when we will have our very first Miss Universe. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Who are you betting? Who's your bet? Who do you think will bring home the Miss Universe? Who's your bet? Who's your Oh, Vega. Okay, but today, as we've promised, we will give you our fearless forecast for the very first Binibining Cebu 2017. And we've actually asked Adrian and Vanessa to give their top five candidates, mm -hmm. and we'll be showing them to you one by one. Okay. Actually, yeah. when, when uh, Ryan called me for this, because I'm very excited, but to me, how can someone see my mga your readers who are watching, no? I've been, um, for pageantry for the Sad, I've been the EP and then the producer for Miss Cebu right. for the past uh, decade, no? 12 years. So, I'm going to tell you that. May karapatan lang. Na, na po ko na. So, the world, you know, but. Ang Messi mo magod do sila kabuo, no? Yeah. Do sila. So magi kani 54 na mga Cristo Cardinal ng guapa. Correct, so, correct. Yeah. But sige, atong sundan. Thank you for fun lang. Yeah, for fun. Having fun. Yeah. 
fun round. Walang kalain ng pag-i-mapin. I know. Yes, fun round. These are our own opinions. Yes. Uh, our own choices. Mm-hmm. Definitely, this will not have any bearing at all <laughs> sa no, choices not, not and judges tomorrow. These are just our own choices. And if you have your own, and if you want to participate in the discussion today, please feel free to comment, mm-hmm. and we will ask your questions live here in the Freeman Conversations. Okay. Um, before we go there, mm-hmm. we'd like to ask how are the candidates? Because tomorrow, tomorrow they will be presenting the top 20 candidates. Yes, from 50. I, I called somebody from the beginning, Cebu. From top 54, of course, they'll turn down to top 20, mm-hmm. and then top 12, and then top 5. Okay. Top five. Mm-hmm. So, so exactly. okay. The top 20 were determined um, based sa four pre-pageant events. Which are yeah. how uh, First, the Philippine Interno Competition, mm-hmm. which happened in Ar- Argao, that's yeah. 20%. September 23, no? Yes. Before my birthday. Then, then <laughs> Swimsuit Competition, that's 25%. Wow. Evening Gown Competition, another 25%. 20% for the interview, and lastly, 10% will come from the committee. The organizing uh, yes. committee, okay. When did so, the interview happen? Oh, last Wednesday. Last Wednesday. Last Wednesday. This is a closed door interview? It is. Yes. It was. It was. It was a closed door interview. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, so that's how they determine the top 20. Mm. In coronation night, they will determine the top 12 through the evening gown competition. Wow. Now. And 50% regality and bearing, mm-hmm. and 50% for beauty. And after that, kung isa makakuhag ng kung scores, pinakatangong scores, mm-hmm. so they will, that will determine the top five, mm-hmm. mag-final question and answer, mm-hmm. 60% for beauty, then 40% for width and intelligence. To clarify, beauty actually pertains to f- facial beauty. Fe- yeah, right. Yes. Beauty of face. Yes. Beauty, beauty of face. Of course, okay. This is, of course, a beauty pageant. A beauty pageant. Yeah. yeah, kanan ang nice ba? Kaya ang committee, gitang di 10%, you know? It plays mm-hmm. a very uh, important role of 10%, okay? Because they are with the they are with the candidates all the time, so they are with the attitude. Yeah. Listen, listen po kaayo na kanang guapa lang niya, judge mm-hmm. of attitude, basta mag attitude. Because <laughs> <laughs> they will be working with a girl for the impact, for one entire year. year. Mm-hmm. So, of course, it's it's just appropriate that we'll be looking for a complete package. Yes, exactly. Because the Bidi Bidding Cebu will not just be representing, like before, mm-hmm. this Cebu was representing Cebu City, right? Mm-hmm. But this one, the winner will represent the whole province. Yes. The whole province of Cebu. But if you watch but the My Cebu thing, that they, they have the like one minute with Cebu, the ilang isulti ko asla di ka. Yes, yes, so yes. nice, proud siya because the videos are kind of mighty pag pag pagahimo, makita gini mga mga tourist spots. Ma proud po ka isa yeah. sa buano to see all the to tourist spots. Ngat ng ipasigab bugin, no? For the entire world, mo na My Cebu. Even us, we learn mm-hmm. something new from our exactly, world. Exactly. Yes. Okay. Okay. No, they don't know. Oh, yeah. in fairness, <laughs> the no. candidates were given the, the opportunity and the platform to highlight the best exactly. of their local government units. Mm-hmm. And, kinsa man yung mga kapabilya talent ang dapat at ngan sa itong mga audience sa waterfront. Yes, well, I know, of course, I'm very proud that it will be hosted by, of course, Lucky Manzano, along with the dad. Mm-hmm. And of course, why well, lying pa, no? the very beautiful Carla Henry. I know that James Lee is coming. Yes. And uh, the Maya Moreno. My Morena girls, yeah, no, uh, hey, hey Joe, Joe. Uh, I will be here also. So all of and them? all of all, them, all, all, yeah, all the kind of wow. Wow. So and I mean, they promise another performer, na nada is Cebuano roots. Oh, so, ano pa? Secret pa para bibet. <laughs> so we'll know that. Nyo kung kisa mga lalaki sa judges, no. So right, right. excited ko kung kisa ang uh, naagil, no. Who's kana hands mo lumukan ng ato mga papiligin ang mga. Manila base man daw tanan. Yes, during the press call, it was discussed oh, yeah. on uh, most of the judges will be coming from Manila. Of so for fresh eyes. For fresh eyes. Yes. yes. Why can I go on? Hello. Mga sa kila kila na beauty. Why na? Pasawa, hello, pasawa. Yes. <laughs> okay, let's go to your choices. Yes. We have actually displayed uh, mm-hmm. pictures of the candidates, and this one's here, the ones in the middle, right smack in the middle. Uh, placed horizontally beside each other are the candidates that both Adrian and Vanessa have chosen. Mm-hmm. Well, same choices, same choices. So we'll discuss both first. Adrian, if you go to the other yeah, side I'll be here, okay. I'll be this. So which one would you like to uncover first? Maybe we go to the one closest to you. Me, this one. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, this one. Okay. Not necessarily we're we're, we're at, uh, picking the top five, but not necessarily in the. Exactly, my order is yes. first to, to, to the fifth, no? so okay. I'll probably say, should I remove this? Yes, yes, yes. I'll remove my heart. Hindi ka, hindi po kami handa. Wala kami, wala kami props. <laughs> of course, um, Maria Higante, no, Bantayan. Actually, she's from uh, Santa Fe, 
no but then of course um gikwa sa bantayan no so uh, we have our first pick here we have Maria Gigante she's 22 years old she stands 5 6 yes and um of course she joined um Bilibini, Pilipinas 2015 yes 15 or so she's taking up philosophy at mm -hmm. San Carlos. Carlos. San Carlos University of San Carlos so imo siyang pick part of the same uh, she's top of my top she's part of my top 4 Actually, ang top four is pili na natin sila ko pagpili na sila mo kawin sa crown. Oh, para di mo. Oh. Okay. What do you like her, Ibian? I've 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 seen her grow. Mm -hmm. No, um, uh, I was with her during Messi Bu times, mm -hmm. and she's really grown up. Mga niya ang yung maturity in terms of um uh paglakaw niya, mm -hmm. in terms of, of uh, physique, no, um. Of course, kano si Maria mas maka, ano siya, maka She's also very eloquent, yeah. Yes, of yes, course. Yes, you know, yes, so, yes. she's one of my, um, not just top five. She's part of my top five. Mm. What about Speaking you, of girl, was I first came across this girl, Miss mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I remember she was one of the favorites. Yes. But then come question and answer portion, yeah. she, she froze, right? Yes. And then they, this was when? Um, 2014. But I forgot what year. Because huh? again, she she sa kira ni dun siya nagdaw na to. Oh, but then, ba si Rain Balzac, di ba? Um, no, 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 no. 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 Murag ni oh, no. Diane Muego. I'm not sure. Yeah, something okay. like that. But di hasa ni yung kagaling. She's a debater in school. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, she's a student leader also. If I'm yes. not mistaken. Part of the student council. She's a part-time model and host. Mm -hmm. And pang join niya Reina na Galiwan, and then finally binibini Pilipinas. Yeah. We, we saw a different Maria. So there was really a conscious effort in her part yeah. to she, she took, herself. She took that as a lesson. Kato yung Miss Cebu ma moment niya. Yes. To show the world that she, she has that yeah. gift of love. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So kaya pa no? Di balik, di worse ba? Di ba kapit di balik ba? Right, with right. a band, right? Diba? So, but then again, another part of the mga naginong nagi sa naganano winner na ilado na ba? Ilado na. So, that's my reason also when I, when I choose my top one, I'll be asked later, no? Yeah. So, our top, top, our top one na pick na kung saan na mo pinaka kuan yun na winner na, we have Maria Higante of Bantayan. And if this is the girl who will represent, you will be the face of Cebu, mm. because again, mm. right, she, can, right. she can top up a storm. Yes. yes, no. yes. Okay, let's go to your next, next choice. Oh. Here, this one. Yes, yes. Okay. This one. Of course, among the people, no one can so hard na to find the oil. We have Lou Dominic Pexon. Dalagete. Dalagete. What's up, Dalagete? Dalagete. 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 Mm-hmm. Can you come Dumaget? Dumaget, man. Lou is 21. Mm -hmm. She's picking up information technology at USJR. Mm -hmm. um, she was a Miss Mandawi title holder. Mm -hmm. And I covered her during that time. And mm -hmm. I really remember writing that uh, this is, uh, she's a Janine Togonon look alike. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes. She does look like okay. Janine Togonon. And then after that, I remember after Miss Mandawi nag na ng aliwan ni Sia, mm -hmm. naka runner up. Mm -hmm. And then finally, karun binibining si Boo. Mm -hmm. And, okay. This I think this Lou is a girl who must appreciate my young beauty up close. Mm -hmm. Okay, because remember I remember when she, person, when she visited yeah. the Freeman right, yeah. and she was made up like make light makeup lang and mm -hmm. her hair down. I really found her pretty compared mm -hmm. to the Philippine terno. Mm -hmm. she's sa akong top picks. Top okay. picks. I really didn't, I didn't like her makeup that time. Mm -hmm. Hindi ko siya ma-appreciate kung heavy yung makeup o kung kanang nakapok na kaana yung hair. Mm -hmm. yeah, but but if, you can, if you guys can just enlighten us a little bit, um, if you know the answer, why do the candidates have heavy makeup on stage? And yes. of course, because the lighting, no? Uh, ah, more about it. Kung ang lighting iso kaayo, so syempre, of course, we have to compete with the... That's why mga makeup artists, when they see, kanan kanan si Dre na Tech Tech Rehearsal, they take a look at look yun, kung saan ka nang... Uh, um, look sa, sa stage or okay. na nai, na nai ilaw. Well, sometimes mga nang hala, mano, man, that's why mga judges yun, mm. we will, um, most of the time yun, they'll have the pre-judging before mm. na makita sa mga Without makeup? Mm. But, but, maybe na makeup light lang, but okay. kita ba nga? Ah, ah, the no, real face. The real face. Yun. Would you look at sa'yo magbuot sa'yo ng styling, yun, coronation na dyan? Like Nasa yung mga hunger, they have their own hunger. Each mm -hmm. one of them, but sila nag, nagpili sa ilang uh, ilang Sanina, si Lani Nana, so na ako na. Will they will they get to pick their the dresses that will be they will be wearing tomorrow, like the evening? I think all of them. The, the press release they sent was they will all be wearing Harry Santiago creations. Mm -hmm. I see, beautiful. Sure, sa sa gown na ako siya. Yes, and you know, Jobert, um, win or lose, we will be seeing more of this girl. Mm -hmm. Why? Because. Aces and Queens and is a talent. Oh, I see. Uh, Aces and Queens is the um, the group of uh, 
Jonas, di ba? Yeah, Jonas Gafford, mm-hmm. you know, the, the guy behind Pia Works ba? Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Jonas Gafford liked her very much. Mm-hmm. So she was in the screening here in Sydney? Yes. Okay. And I saw pictures of her as a screening pretty kasi dito. She was in a black LBD and mm-hmm. her hair down. To me ba? To me ha, sa 54 ka kang guest, mm-hmm. parang ako siya, pinaka Flores mo na ka. During the... the, the, the more, than, more than more than Chris Smith? Simpson? Huh? Katong that time, yun, uh-huh. parang ako maging... Like fleeting, no? Oh, like, yeah, she walks, yeah. but like, oh, hang, the blue towel, sir. If I remember correctly, when they visited the Freeman, a few of them visited mm-hmm. the Freeman. Uh, she was one of those who, mm-hmm. were, who was here, mm-hmm. uh, who were here, and she actually told us that she was already very confident mm-hmm. in the way she walked mm-hmm. on stage. So she prepared more in other areas, not yes. necessarily in walking, because she was really confident. I reviewed your Facebook live with the girls, and she was yeah. a natural on camera. She was a natural on camera. Very natural. Yes, yes. Very natural. That's true. That's true. Um, when, when during the swimming competition, she has long strides, mm-hmm. and pretty face, really calm and she was like, she was like, she was like, she was I'm having fun here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I already said this in Banatanay, no? but I, I, I heard so many good things about this girl. Mm-hmm. Now, Queen Lee is on mm-hmm. and off stage. Yes. Like, Queen Lee in the manner that if you say something negative to her about another person, mm-hmm. you know, what you're I don't want to hear that. Mm-hmm. She doesn't want any negativity. Mm-hmm. So, so let's see how she she has, she And she's right? never late, though. Uh, she rather, she'd rather not come, though, than be late. I see. Uh, I see. Mm-hmm. So Queen down the shop. So what's it was the most valid time that you know guys managed to be that never. So on time is today. So go 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 was the way that's the way to go. Alright. Who Dominic picks on of Dominic Dominic picks on of the mag uh, of Dalaget. Okay, yeah, the third choice. Third choice. Okay, choice. Let's open. Open Sesame again. Oh, there you go. There you, there you have it. <laughs> Another veteran in the mm-hmm. beauty pageant world. Maria Gigantes Batch sa Binibining Pilipinas. Mm-hmm. Ito nga year, 20... But you think she 20, made it to the top 15 also? Yes. No? Sa Binibining Pilipinas. Yes. So, April Smith, okay. no? Representing Badyan. Okay. Ang akong check ka ni Dai. Oh, okay. Check up, check ka ni. Giiloga ni siya. Na because, mm-hmm. of course, when you joined um, this, 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 this contest, okay, she won somewhere else, she won somewhere else. Uh-huh. And of course, among the people that na, 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 she chose Badyan, she chose Badyan. Because I remember that Badyan is she. Yeah, she won as Miss Badyan. Okay, a bit of background on April Smith, she's 21. Mm-hmm. She took up tourism sa University of San Carlos. But I think they stopped she pa siya for now because okay. Manila Bay's pa siya for because she's she, an Asian she Queen's talent. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay, and. Um, in fact, she hosted the Ace and Queen screening. Oh, I see. Okay. September is a Golden Week hotel. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mas unti ko na ako ni April Smith. No, I for me she's the queen of the round. No, mm-hmm. para kung ano yung beat ni Ali when it comes to runway and mm-hmm. walking, stage mm-hmm. projection. Mm-hmm. Um, put her with uh ten other girls on stage, and your eyes will really gravitate back to her. Mm-hmm. Not, she really stands yes, out on stage. Not only because of her height, but mm-hmm. because of her projection. Not only because, oh. of, because of her, her color. Yes. She's a beautiful color. Beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember when evening gown competition, mm-hmm. na ako yung mention ng other candidate. I, I saw one other candidate for a copy in her. Kano ganin yung a trademark pose, a coy smile. Mm. Or, what, what is that? What is um, that? Um, dramatic pose first, and then a coy smile after. I can't copy it though. Iwala na ako hawa. Ikan ang April Smith jud. Ang ang tapat April Smith. Yes. No. I'm but, secret girl also. I saw her sa mga um, ano pa ako ng interview ng spa. Uh, no sa India si Bian ng mga Miss Miss no. And, and then uh, when she became a model, which of course is my favorite. Mm-hmm. No? In fact, uh, in, uh, in our coming uh, World Aids Day run, she's one of our ambassadors to promote the uh, the cause also uh, on December 2 in Ayala. What about her communication yes. skills? Now, no, ang ibon ko, na before, more more kang, hala, hala, guapa na, lami na kay make up, lami kay lawas, pretty cute eh, more makapause ka, no? But then I think, because of also experience, yeah. mga ibon ko na, this girl's ready. So okay. this, oh, okay. oh, 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 it's anybody's game yet because um you'll never know. You're really prepared. You'll never know. No, you'll never know. You'll and also know. maybe because since she was still starting at that point, mm-hmm. she wasn't very confident yet. Mm-hmm. So still a lot to learn because she was also still very young. But based uh, because of the experiences now you've mentioned, mm-hmm. she also joined Mini Bini Filipinas. Mm-hmm. I'm sure uh, she and Maria mm-hmm. learned a lot from there mm-hmm. in the national pageant. Okay. And who knows though from Miss Man our reigning Miss Mandawi Rosfila Lewis. Yes. Now Black American. Mm-hmm. Right. 
What if dito binibinis mo? Ni nga po si Ibu Smith Han ang mga tao na they say na ah para sa sila naman kadaog because they enjoy na. Hindi po siya kasi kanang hindi po siya ang may advantage ang um fresh face kay hindi ba mo ah fresh face siya pag maybe dark horse or something but sila po being mga nag this is called veterans sa mga pageantry, sa mga pageants. Marang pag, tapos na, makulo kung kaayon na kung, di ba, binibili na niya, di na sa masasang top 20, no? So, I mean, double effort po, no? For them to become, I mean, Really shine. I remember last April when this pageant was launched, Carrie Santiago said that the winner, the top winner, will be the winner. The winner, the top winner, will be the winner. The winner, the top winner, will be the winner. The winner, the top winner, will be the winner. Undoubtedly, legend, unquestionably, unquestionably beautiful. And I think pasok si April. Pasok, yes. Yeah. Oh. yeah. And I think it's my personal opinion that if you are a veteran, mm -hmm. that's both a positive and negative for you because yes. of course people will expect a lot from mm -hmm. you. So that, that's the negative side of it because mm -hmm. you really have to make sure that you perform. Mm -hmm above the others. Mm -hmm. I think that's the pressure that they are facing. But of course, the advantage there is the experience. Mm -hmm. um, I'm sure if you're a veteran, mm -hmm. you have more confidence when you're already on stage. Si Ibu Smith, she wore a Carlos Diago gown pag itong pink October. The same gown worn by Pia Rochba. Which one? The color? Pink, not now. Oh, same. So, maybe we could be a sign that she's been wearing that, you know? I don't know. We don't know yet. But of course, it's my husband. Look, same gown. Let's be, you know, let's see. Okay, so we're rooting for being. Actually, I'll be, I'll have my, I know with, um, but yeah. Okay. Tanay mo, patakpan yun siya. Yeah, to me, ha, to me, ha. Because of course, that when they, they start, they're like, oh, 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 like, I think the film suit or something. So, probably, to her, that's an advantage, eh. You know, that's an advantage, eh. And the top 12 Q&A, so, let's see. Because sometimes, maybe, even if you're prepared, even if you're experienced, but then, that moment na, Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. She can do that with eyes closed. This is a girl that you can give a sack to wear and she can make it look like high fashion. Yes. Wow, those are very strong words. So there you have it. Bantayan, Dalagete, and Banyan. Mm -hmm. Those are three candidates that both Adrian and Vanessa have chosen. Mm -hmm. um, same choices. Now we go to the candidates that... Okay. Adrian and Vanessa and or did not choose. So let's begin with Adrian. Okay, here. Um, okay, here. Okay. There you go. Our gal, we have of course Tracy Perez. She's a um, akong background niya is a culinary agent, and then she she was a runner up, no? Of uh, I'm not too sure if it was it Rainbow Jack. Rainbow Jack. Rainbow She's the first runner up of Rainbow. Oh, there you go. So she's an engineer. Yes. Even even if my uh, my ano is probably. To her during the swimsuit, during the gown, she was just very charming. And then to her, uh, to me, ang yung lakaw is very calm, lang pero very elegant, no? Elegant ka ayon. And my story, yeah. okay. to me, um, I don't think else, but my story, yeah, yeah. guapa, simple lang. Very wow, my And she's a very classy, classy very classy, pretty, classy you know? look. So, okay. uh, Tracy Paris. Yeah. How about ni Argo, no? ni, ni Tracy Paris? She mm -hmm. screams sophistication for me. I mm -hmm. like her Philippine terno look. Mm -hmm. Um, kwa sa mong video, she comes off too serious for me. Mara uh -huh. na 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 siya yung pagkaka ng snobbish na beauty. Uh -huh. Basin ko kaya wala mong gulo na ka FaceTime o ka up close and personal niya. But that's okay. pero ko ni dati niya na ako sa yung video. She comes mm -hmm. off. Tracy. She comes off <laughs> so you have fun now. Oh, but it's because you're playful side. But maybe yeah. it's because I have this, and I am for her because during Miss Cebu, Merbag, you know, she she can be a a winner, you know, she can be a winner. Yeah. But then during the time, Ray was the was the crowd's favorite, no? Yeah. But then it was not for her. Yeah, not, not for her. her. Not, not for her. So let's see, let's see. Let's oh. see tomorrow. Let's see tomorrow. For, and then for our lifestyle report, important for the rapper, no? Mm -hmm. I also asked him about Tracy Mano, and then for him, though, in a sea. If you're watching, in a sea of beautiful other faces, no, mo 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 kwan na siya mo. No, forgettable na daw. Ah, forgettable. Okay, okay. So mo wala mo wala ng siya. Para na ni Ramon ha. Para ni Ramon. Okay, okay. Ramon. But but Ken here or all my reporter who's handling the camera is very happy because. It's his neighbor. She's her neighbor. I'm sorry, Ken. In Argao. So he's very happy with your choice, Adrian. Argao. Actually, last night I was like picking and then Ryan said, Oh, um, hello, mo, I don't know if you favorite. And then, if you open your, I don't know, your, uh, 
tip for that. Yeah, my top one. Yeah. Okay. Your top one? She's your top one? Yeah, she is. Asa di okay, go. We'll open it now. Uh, later. Uh, let's, let's, let's move on to okay. Indian's choice first. Okay, here, Manan. Okay, I have your fifth choice, Indian. This is Bini Bini Linglanilia. Linglanilia. Ingrid Yes. Why did you choose her to be the top five? I, I saw the fir the first um because I missed the I missed the Philip Interno. Uh -huh. When I saw her doing swimsuit uh -huh. and I saw her up front in a white makeup and then with makeup I went kagwapan by Hannah. For me, somebody like for from from TV, ganun ako sa kwaon as a TV talent, TV really guapa. She looks very good on camera. Very good. Guapa in, uh, sa camera, guapa in person, daily update, mm -hmm. kana mura kay, um, very polite. Mm -hmm. no? So, when I saw her during the gown put, she had a blue gown. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yung kwan kamay ko nga, kanang, kanang guapa, mo, mo, ang yang nao illuminate, no? Mm -hmm. And then, and she's tall. You know, yeah, she's, tall. she's tall and very queenly also. So, even in that picture, she's already very pretty. No, so makaingon ko na. Very uh, Filipina features. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to say, 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 they say, but I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I don't know what I think Ramon also, I, I also asked Ramon, he was really not so blah blah blah. But then, they're having a training. They had. I know that the girls went to trainings with a um, with a, with speeches. Mm -hmm. yeah. How they answer. Yeah. So I think Sana, no, I'm rooting for her. So okay. let's see. Because sometimes there are girls not who can really speak Mansa. Yes. But when when they're already in front of people, that's yes. when maybe awesome. come. Yes. Mm -hmm. Because of the nervousness, it's really an aspect. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go to Vanessa. What did you choose? Who did you choose? Actually, again, let me say, no, nga, I, 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 I quick rakay ko nga naka list down sa kong top four, but it, I really struggle with who my fifth girl will be. Mm -hmm. Okay, na ako yung mga gopahan jud, mm -hmm. but dilijig ko confidence sa ilang speaking skills. Mm -hmm. Na ako, na ako ganahan ko sa ilang communication skills, mm -hmm. pero Di feel na ako ilang beauty kay matabunan jud. So, after. Nasunapo ko ana. No, napod na choices. After deep thought, mm -hmm. so I settled with Bini Bining Medellin, mm -hmm. Nika Zosa Nabua. Mm -hmm. Okay. She reminds me of Banks Garcia. What do you think? Yes, no? Also, we are I just said okay. Okay. Um, their first pre pageant event, mm -hmm. the Interno competition, she surprised everyone because mm -hmm. she's, she tied with April Smith as mm -hmm. best in Hablon. Mm -hmm. Right? Wow. I missed that, no? In our girl. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. the judges must have seen something in her. Mm -hmm. with April Smith mm -hmm. during their first pre pageant. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hablo, of course, by uh, designed by Dash and Alas. Yeah. She must have performed really good that night. Yes. Mm -hmm. She's a biology student at Cebu Doctors University, mm -hmm. aspiring doctor. And I saw Ramon's video of her. Mm -hmm. okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Yes, yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. But feel the horror. Kung makapasok siya sa top 5 runner-up. Mm -hmm. Go, go, go. What do you think of her picture? Very beautiful. Yeah, Very beautiful. pretty. Pang-artista. Yes. Artistahin kayo o beauty. Yeah. Pang-artista. Yeah. Yeah. Five, six. Pang-artista. 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 What's the minimum height for Bini Bini? I think 5'5". 5'5". You have to be an artist. You mean Cebu? Or Bini? Bini 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 Okay. So why did you choose her? Okay. Quick background lang, no? Yes, sure, She's sure. 24. She's a nursing student at University of Cebu. Mm -hmm. She was also one of the girls who the last minute no on the screen sa mm -hmm. Aces and Queens. Yes. And then no tana na mi show kung kinsa si Jonas Gaful. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> so I asked her handler, her manager Swen Shuang, uh, mm -hmm. how long na madeli siya sa Pinas? Kano mm -hmm. mi siya kailan Jonas Gaful? So 
two years pa din siya sa Cebu. Mm -hmm. Alright. But in yeah. the modeling and fashion industry, five months pa daw. I see. So that's the reason why yeah, karon pa siya nakailan. Where did she come from? Um, her mother is Cuban. Mm. Alright, yeah. And her dad is Filipino-Chinese. Okay. Mag-visit-visit na daw ni sila sa una pa dahil sa Cebu, but two years ago pa lang dyan sila ni move permanently here. Mm. For her studies and eventually okay. for work. Which explains, yeah. 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 So that's the reason why she she seems unpolished mm -hmm. on stage. Mm -hmm. And our raw pa jud. Yeah. Yeah. Would you agree with me nga dilik pa jud kaya siya kay Bawang Lakaw? Di ko makain mo na dilik ka Bawang Lakaw. But I think she can walk, but then compared to the others, mm -hmm. right? she's, she's, she's a little behind, no? Mm -hmm. Right? Kailan ko na, um, napasinaghang sa Tagalog pa, marami magbigas na kainin, no? Pero yeah. with the right training, mm -hmm. and the right dress, the right makeup, and with the right have a lot, no? Also a lot, no? Because it's a very important role. No matter how quiet you have, prepare you are, prepare you are, kung ang lot na factor wala ni mo, no? So, because for example, if you prepare a lot for it, and then you stumble five times on stage. Yes. <laughs> yeah. That's really bad luck, right? Actually, when uh, when I was asked, she was my fifth girl, then, I don't know who I'm going to pay for it. Oh my god, I'm a studious guy! She's part of my top picks here, but then... But then, five women here, five women here. Yeah, questionably, I doubt that she's very beautiful. What? Yeah, the usual story, you know, she didn't plan on joining modeling or pageants, and then after a bit of prodding, she finally relented. And her first pageant, actually, was this Miss Mandawa Disney. And then, I remember, I remember thinking, she reminded me of Maggie Wilson. Yes, it's an image in this photo. Karun na, makita ko na kasi Sofia ang dress niya. How did she, how did she fare in the in Miss Mandawi? Um, she she seemed awkward. Mm -hmm. The way she posed, the way she walked on stage. But mm -hmm. then um, Q and A, okay, man, spontaneous. Mm -hmm. But then for some reason, wala siya na kimaw. She didn't make it to the top five. Wala siya. Wala siya. Probably. Na, the final, final is yes, the probably because of kada nai mga factor ko like tapos mga sports sports or anything. Ah yeah yeah. Ano yung mga attendance na nasa di tama ako ako but. Among the girls na kung imo sa maglinyang fifty four double off, hindi ko na hala kagawa pa yas tayo yas na usas sa mga mulugu ang beauty sa yeah when I was looking at the pictures of the winning Cebu for the first time when they posted the official pictures, this one really stood out. Gawa pa yun, no question about it. So we wish her the best of luck tomorrow. And if our only complaint about her is, "Dey pa kaysa mga ayong muram," but unlike you know, maybe the Filipinas or the Philippines, you know, their intention is for their winner to be sent to international pageants. At bini bini si Budiliman, because you know, just to be the ambassadors of our tourism. So you know, really, more really, kaysa big factor, bini pa siya kaayong mga ayong muram pa. So brad, ang mas mga tao wala sa bawa ba? Di sa automatic when they when they wales bini bini si Cebu. They automatically go to Manila and join the Philippines. Yeah, because that's a common question. Yes. Do you send the winner to the Philippines? Actually, no, that's not really the goal. Because okay, like looking at the logo, di ba? The logo of the Philippines, you know, di ba? When you mention the Philippines, di ba? So when you think that it's a franchise, so during the past, it was kind of clear that it's not a franchise as of yet. No, okay. Probably, you know, when they, you know, ang ang Philippines ba yung pila ng Philippines? Forty five. But yeah. lesser than 54. They, they had, I know they had 50, yeah, about yeah. 15 or something. Uh -huh. Can you 54 ka buong, no, logistics wise? Di lang limo. But their pre-pageant events were, you know, world class. Yes, they know kung panakukan ngayon. Well, eh. this is a Cebu creation. Mm -hmm. So it must be world class, yes, right? No? Cebu, Cebu, I know, so never settle for anything. And those were just a pre-pageant. So imagine what we're tomorrow. going to do tomorrow. So that's right. why... Excited, ko. Yes, yes, yes. Excited, ko sa tomorrow. Production numbers, of course. Being Nadia, si, of course, may the very good, very talented, no, Victor Cuenco, no. So let's see, kung ang unsang mga mubna, no, for tomorrow's opening number, right? No, sa mga the stage design with Connect with Kenneth Cuenco. In fact, no, to limit the, of course, the Argao, no, bongga na kaayo. Ang swimsuit na kaawa, so I was hoping na maging nasa sa mga sa mga beach, no, and then. Okay. Lucy said, I can't eat it with the dagat. And an evening gown with a James Bond theme and the live orchestra. And what I really like about this competition, more than the beauty pageant aspect of it, is that it really brought the local governments together. So like Argao helped in organizing the... Hablon, the Terno competition. They had Hablon, and then this is the most important thing 
exposure, okay, you have to have blood first, yes. and then the uh, Philippine the term. So, the Philippine term. exposed for you. So, of course, can you have a tough time in here, mga... But viewers, viewers, viewers <laughs> like, may ito kong mga kafriman. <laughs> no, these are our own lang, no? Um, yes, these are our own. bearing again. But then, um, we've seen, we have, we have our own reasons. We've seen that these girls throughout the years, no, sa, sa modeling world, sa world pageantry. That's right. And of course, Vanessa be having interviewed the girls, no? Yes. So, uh, we're really hoping, no, that uh, our picks are... This same as theirs, no? So let's see. Let's have a recap. Let's have a recap mm -hmm. of your choices. So Adrian's choices are Bantayan, uh, Argao, Bantayan, Minglanilla, Dalaguete, and of course, Bagyay. And three of the, the ladies are also the choices of Vanessa, including Man, your two others. I have Madeleine, Nicanagua, Asturias, Samantha Law, Isa Tokong Isa. Those are the three, oh, the three of them. Okay. okay. And by the way, Adrian, Robert, would you like to know how the crown looks like? Pag-sight ko. No, I'm very... Hindi hey, ba? Mga iwan ka na ang, um, ang mga... Ang crown, yung isa sa mga tangan, no? The living of Miss World, uh, the blue crown. Yes. Yeah. Ako, I've seen uh, during the Miss Cebu, bro, I think, katulog ng ilis ng crown, mm, no? Actually, so, um, di, di ko makabaw kung... Uh, do you have a research on that? Actually, nato. She has a crown now. Oh, you have a crown? I'm not allowed to show it? Yes! Oh my goodness, only here in Freeman! <laughs> and three, two, one, go! Oh. The crown of the very first Binibining Cebu 2017. This is by Oro China Jewelry. It's made of pure gold, studded with diamonds, rubies, and sapphires. Designed by Cari Santiago with insights from Kenneth Cobonpue. Okay. What do you guys think? How much? How much? How much does it cost? I'm excited to come. Okay, I know for a fact that I'm going to crown. I'm going to call it a compadre. I'm going to keep. Can a girl, can a girl... Keep this? Uh, it's it's a good way. Keep it. 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 How beautiful, no? I wonder how heavy it is, di ba? Um, oh, but, um, but it's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. So that's it. Mona. It's very beautiful. So hopefully, hopefully we'll never know. No, this so, so I'm not surprised. I mean, this has like shown in the... Well, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's Of course, no, that's the advantage of being the editor, my oh. guys. No? So, so oh. baka, we'll give you a Sa mga salitan, sa mga salitan, di ba ba? Wala pa. Okay, ayun sa Missy Boy, kaya mga mga fashion shows, mga mga sketches, wala sa mga 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 mga. Basta ay Kari Santiago. Basta tomorrow, I'm very excited kung sa ang look, no? Even if the swimsuit, di ba? Kaya, mga mga swimsuit ng mga girls, mga mga gown again, mga mga Q&A again. Oh my God, very excited ko sa Q&A mo, wala akong niyak ngayon. No? So, but ang Q&A ang top 12, no? Top 5! So let's see, no? Okay. Osa ang look for tomorrow. Let's see tomorrow. Also aside from the top five, magkuha ko the cash prize ang municipalities and towns or cities that they represent. So for example, ako magbibini ng Cebu. I know twenty thousand. Oh, di ba pa two hundred thousand? Lagi ang 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 LG you are representing. Wow. And the top 12 will get 30k. The reason behind that is because it's not proud. 30k or again? Okay. Mm. No, um, 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 top 12. Okay, 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 the okay, candidates. Okay. Because 54 mo ko na makadidata, so there's a very slim chance na makadaw mo. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Let's give 30k to the top 12. But okay. you know what? Kano na, now that official in, in the budget, each girl has 10,000. Oh. So if you do the math, it's like half a million. Oh, 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 half a million. Sure. Five, 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 five million forty, mm -hmm. di ba? Like, can you imagine, di ba? But the cash price notwithstanding, I think ang tanang lengua sa ito mga girls is just mm -hmm. to be a part of the first binibining scene. Yeah, scene, history, right? no? They are a really part of history. Yes, yeah, it's part of the, for 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 the first batch, no? Pioneer. Pioneer. Oh, so I think the challenge now of Binibini Cebu is to sustain yeah. the grandiosity of the pageant. How to search for another 54? <laughs> but I'm sure. No, I'm sure. Dito mag okay, Cebu has a lot of like, beauty queens. Mm -hmm. But they have a lot of mga wanya appeal. Mga uh, nga wanya appeal. No, I, I just bump it to Gazzini kung nga wanya appeal dahi. Siya kung puli malapit. Gazzini. 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 Gazzini Ganados. Yeah, okay. Uh, we have Stephanie Abramastori. Abramastori. Yeah. Yeah. So, Hello, Catalinco! Yes! She joined the Philippines. 
yes, that's right. I heard. Oh. No? So, Cebu never runs out of beef. Yes. Ayan ina mga mamuho na ina mga kisa na dita na rin na, no? And I'm sure that the local government units, basing on mm -hmm. uh, the curiosity of the very mm -hmm. first edition this year, will mm -hmm. never hesitate to send and support candidates. Is this going to be every year? Na? That's the goal. That's the okay. goal. That's the goal. Uh, actually, it is, of course, the towns of Wanakabao. This is a project also of the uh, alumni of no, Sacred Heart. Okay. Look, I'm Batch 1985. Yes. Can you buy a five dish? Can you buy a Okay, go I know Santa Barili. Okay, I'm going to say Santa Fe. Santa Fe, yes. Jewel of the Philippines. Yes. Well, I love friend also. Yes, no. And she quit her job for it to be to focus full time. Such an education for the fashion. Yes. Yes. Ganapon ni Carmel. Oh, ganapon ni kisama si Kuya. Oh, Jonas Gafford loved Carmel. Oh, si Moselle Blake Madero. Oh, ganapon ni um Monica Tawide. But she's like, yes. kung saan ang kanya siya lamay, dapat isang kaon. No? <laughs> <laughs> They were high twice. No, or kulang. Kulang. Oh, no. Kaya so, oh. yung guapa. Uy, makalibo ang sinasang guapa. Kaya siya. 55. We're talking about 55. Iba mo yung nagili pa sa Basta. Ay, Cordova! It's also very beautiful. Do they have the same set of judges for the during the pre pageant competitions? Or no, different. Different, different. So, so different from. Um, I know, if I remember. Okay, what I noticed is that I'm going to go to events, exactly like a closed door interview. I'm going to go to the judge in all kinds of things. Yes. I see. I know Mia, actually, I asked Mia, I know someone in the page. But I'm not out. So I think probably that's why they chose the, the, these two girls, you know. So probably I'm stand out during that. But I'm having fun, you know. In fact, 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 Fairly, mm -hmm. you know, I mean, and now, like, of course, I'm talking to first thing about my models, no? so in which I will judge the girls based on performance. Karon, karon mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Jo Marie Eliana was one of the judges of swimsuit competition, mm -hmm. and okay. it was seated beside Kobon mm -hmm. When it was April Smith's turn on stage, I, would, I, I know I observed Kobon mm -hmm. whisper something to. Jo Marie, and then bisag na nandiyan sa far end of the stage, si April Smith wala jo no know yung talaga ni Jo Marie. Totok is Jo Marie dahil. Impression siya ni April Smith. So I wonder if it's not the Rana as a kid, it's Rana. So there you have it, the top picks of the Freeman Entertainment editor, Vanessa Balbuena, and of course, ABS-CBN Entertainment head, Adrian Byongzun. Hello guys! Adrian Byongzun, who joined us today. These are their top choices. Argao, Bagtayan, Danilia, Dalagete, Asturias, Batian, Minidian. If you want to share your top choices, mm -hmm. please feel free to comment. I wonder if there are any comments now that we can read, no? Sa itong mga viewers for... Sa itong, sa itong 1,000 followers. <laughs> <laughs> how do you call that thing? I, I, I have not been alive. Viewers. What viewers. Is viewers. Viewers. Okay, viewers. Okay, viewers. viewers. Yeah. So, so... Do we have there? Okay, mga... Yes, sir. Alegria though. Alegria. What were your thoughts? Alegria. Alegria. Is this Jumanji? Sakto ba na? Pag-spect? 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 Oslob daw, Oslob! Oslob! Ah, I can't remember their names now. Ah, sige. So hopefully, hopefully you will support your candidates, whoever your choices are. Hopefully you will support them tomorrow during the finals at the waterfront. At the Grand Ballroom. The Grand Ballroom. 7.30pm. At the waterfront Cebu City Hotel at 7pm. And of course, the Freeman and Vanities will be there to give you the latest updates as the Finals of the very first bidding bidding Cebu will happen to her. Imagine if you're a fan of Cebu, you're a supporter of the municipalities and cities. I'm sorry, I've watched Miss Cebu for the past few years. And they don't have food dressing rooms. So I can't imagine if I'm going to have 54 people. But there's a lot of people who are going to have 54 people. But there's a lot of people who are going to have 54 people. But there's a lot of people who are going to have 54 people. But there's a lot of people who are going to have 54 people. I wonder how they must have opened um, function rooms. Oh, yeah. Yeah, layo ka ayun. Mga gusto mo yung pagdala ng mga girls, di ba? Okay, taas ang taas ang ang waterfront. In fact, kung, kung sa gawas pa ng daan, pero taas ang nalakaw, no? So it must be a really, really, dinagana yung 
Ano yun? Sabi ka mo, stop na. O pa ligaw sa sakagayo. Remember, happiness ba yun sa mga bayo? No. So, bisa kung saan na siya ka-kiyotes. So, can you imagine na may, kung, really, sorry sa tayo, kung bayo ka, di po di, agawa ko, di po di po, di po, di ba? Oh, bro, si the water fun. So, imagine siya, dapat 4 p.m. pala, ano mas water fraud, yan, ang traffic, tapos magpalamat ka. And it's a Saturday. It's a Saturday Oh my God, the traffic. Oh my goodness. So, our roles relate to the water front Cebu City Hotel tomorrow for the finals of the very first bidding Cebu Yes, tomorrow. Kapa may mas mga ka. Thank you. And of course, please don't forget to read Adrian's column at Banat News every Saturday. Hmm, ogma ay nako. At ano ogma ang singer diva ng ito liso? Oi, di alam ko yung local TV host. This happened here. This happened in Cebu. My God, no singer di di ano ano ang ang local TV host o ibang kung kisang kami kung local TV host tag ano pa dito kung perfect but you will have to tell us later actually di ko nasa mo sa TV sa mga 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 it's an honor to have you with us. Hopefully you can Next join us. Yes, Next year next time. time. <laughs> and if you want to know more the candidates of Bini Bini Cebu, please don't forget to visit the photos uh, section of the free man here on Facebook and go to the playlist Bini Bini Cebu 2017 and you can watch the candidates individually as they introduce themselves and highlight the very best of the local government unit they are representing. Can I greet? Sure. Hi to the Big C team. Thank you for my Hi, Jaja. <laughs> Hello, Big C. Thank you Bye. very much. <laughs> so there you have it. Our special edition of the Freeman Conversations. And Jobert Alcao, the online editor of the Freeman. See you next year for our fearless forecast of Bidi Bidi Cebu. <laughs> Hopefully 2018. <laughs> no pressure, guys. Thank you very much for joining us today on behalf of Adrian and Vanessa. Join us again next time here on the Freeman Conversations. Bye.